Hello, Joana. Could you introduce Hello. yourself? <laughs> yes, sure. I'm Joana Pereira. Uh, I am from the University of Aveiro and I'm here on NIF as uh, the responsible for working with bivalves and uh, for the le leadership of uh, World Package 1. So tell us, what is bioremediation actually? What does it mean? Uh, what is bioremediation? Bioremediation is a complex concept of course, but uh, to put it in a simple way is use the use of biological resources to improve the environment, so to remove contaminants, to try to treat uh, in a biologically based way uh, water for consumption, for example, and this does not mean necessarily for human consumption, but for, for example, for supporting ecosystem services and so on, and the same for soil and other environmental matrices. But you work closely with clams. Yes. yes. Is that correct? <laughs> yes. Uh, is it true that clams could be a, the, the factor which will clean the environment for us? Yeah, I mean, uh, it's not yet, of course, proven, and that's why we are uh, investigating this topic. Um, but we, what we know is that they are able to uh, remove some pollutants from water. Okay, uh, they are filter feeders and so they filter large amounts of water and some species have the ability to tolerate some levels of contaminants and so we can use this service um, to remove and at least concentrate the pollutants inside the clam so that it can be easier to then remove the whole burden from the ecosystem, then removing them the pollutants from large amounts of water, for example. This can be harmful for plants? Or... Uh, in, at, at very high concentrations, yes, of course, but some, some clam species are what we call hyperaccumulators of some contaminants, of metals and some organic contaminants. And so they, they tolerate uh, significant concentrations of uh, pollutants and that's why we are looking at them as a possibility to, uh, in, this, in the case of NIFE, to remediate uh, uh, within what wastewater treatment processes. So you think this is the future? To keep an uh, environment clean? I keep, I keep my hope on that, <laughs> but uh, we still need, to, we still have um, a long way until we can uh, really um, use them safely and use them in the most efficient way so that it can be uh, both environmentally beneficial but you're also economically feasible. So we need to, to keep all these, these two dimensions in mind uh, for the research in NIFA and for proposing this kind of solution. So thank you very much. I keep my fingers crossed that it will <laughs> out you. for like, you know, hopefully. Yeah, <laughs> check it out on NIMFA webpage about more solutions uh, like this based on a biological organism. Thank you very much, Anna. Thank you.